Hello, and welcome to the first, I guess, real series on my channel that isn't just a stupid replay video or anything like that. And we are going to be doing Half-Life, one of the greatest games ever made by anyone. Um, this was kind of, this was my first game I ever got on Steam, and it's definitely one of my favorites, so, yeah, I think we'll be playing that. During the, um, intro cinematic, I guess you would call it, I won't be talking, so you can just absorb into your skin the beauty of the opening. So, without any further ado, let's go. Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees, with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. This train is inbound from Level 3 dormitories to Sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond Sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound. No smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to use the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. this evening at 1900 hours in the level 3 facility. The semi-finals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure access transmission. Remember, more lives than your own may depend on your fitness. Do you have a friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with the in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruitment team. The Black Mesa Research Facility is an open opportunity. to all Black Mesa personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. 
Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. And with that, we are here. Uh, I know that... Well, actually, for anyone who hasn't played or seen this game before, you can move around, look around on that train ride. But I prefer not to. I feel like it's a good experience just to see all of the beauty around you. Especially considering the time this game was released, it looks really nice. How's your day going, Barney? Sorry, I'm on duty. Thanks for the good conversation. You uh, you can die. This is the uh, first area you can die in the game. Uh, you can just jump right off this railing. Or if you're like me, you actually can jump over onto that railing and like go behind where you're not supposed to go. It's it's pretty neat. Chapter 2, Anomalous Materials. Here we go. It's beautiful. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. My hey, God, what are that. you doing? <laughs> Come on, Gordon. You trying to get me into trouble? <laughs> uh, that's always fun. So, yeah, here we are in the beautiful Black Mesa Research Facility. Which Greetings. Has... Greetings to you too, sir. You'll just have to wait until after the test. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago? I don't know, weren't you supposed to get a better I job? Must remember to report that fluctuation. Oh. Hey, let's see what's going on in there. Just, I just can barely not hear what they're saying. Hmm. Very interesting. Hello there. I can't be bothered right now. Well, screw you too, sir. Have a nice day. Are you running those tunneling lattice calculations again? Here's what I love about the game. Right. Yep. Just, just doing, just doing my work. Top of this guy's head, you know. No one even cares. No one even minds. Ah, it's good to see you. Okay, good to see you too. <laughs> Have fun. My God, what are you doing? I wonder, is he turn the lights back on? I don't know. Let's go. Let's go. Do what we're told. Go put on our test Hello. suit. Hello, sir. Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy now. Well, then don't try to start a conversation. Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Good to see you, too. I hope those containment parameters are still nominal. My god, what are you doing? <laughs> 
Have a nice lunch, sir. Nah, uh, that's the best part about this opening. Um, so something you might not have known: all of these names Why on do these. Why we uh, all have to wear these ridiculous ties? I Why know, do right? we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Uh, something you might not have known is that all of the names on these lockers, except for of course Freeman, are um, actually the names of people who work at Valve. For some reason, not like. New Newell or any of the two the two owners who made Valve but still people who work there and inside of your locker here there's well first there's a oh, actually I'll show you what that does later but there's this picture of a baby that a lot of people think might be Chell from the Portal series which I always like to think it's a nice little theory Sorry, sir. That's a very, very blocky looking limit. faucet. Just gonna dry my head. Oh, beautiful. Feel much better now. And in here, we have our beautiful HEV suit. That is one of the main like trademarks that. of the series. And something that's very nice is that when you put this on, as I Welcome expected, to the HEV Mark IV protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. High impact reactive armor. Yeah, this is awesome. Activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Defensive weapon selection system activated. Munition level monitoring activated. Communication interface online. Have a very safe day. And with that, we have our beautiful HEV suit. And now I think is the perfect time to end off the first real episode on my channel. So next time on Half-Life, we'll continue exploring the Black Mesa Research Facility. Bye.